Hey, welcome back to your Caribou Daily Science Channel, Spain. This is the afternoon of uh, September the 15th, 2020. It's time for your daily COVID-19 analysis. First of all, a big shout out to the to the four young people who, who watched this video yesterday. Thank you so much for those views, okay? Of course, also, don't forget to subscribe and share these videos with your friends and family. You can, you can do it on Facebook, on, on Twitter. You can also do it, copy and paste the link to the video into an email or text message, okay? So let's just take a look. You know, the thing we need to remind ourselves about COVID-19 vaccine is, at least, at least in the U.S., is that it's not designed to keep you from getting COVID-19, okay? It's designed to reduce the chances that you will die from COVID-19. And the way it reduces the chance that you'll die is by reducing the severity of the, of the disease itself. Okay, so we can see here that Spain currently has uh, 4.9 million cases, uh, 85,548. Uh, the mortality just means that the ratio of cases to death is increasing. Now here we can see here, here's, here's probably the best news for today. Uh, you started you, you started to, to climb up, you know, uh, a lot of kind of, you know, Israel, Israel, uh, Sweden, and the U.S. all all saw an increase in cases in the middle part of July. But while you had a while you had an increase, you also had a, 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 a now it's starting to climb back down. So on on September the 14th, you had 3,261 cases. For the seven-day period ending September the 9th, you were averaging 5,824 cases per day. Now what about deaths? While you are seeing an increase in deaths. It's not a very big increase. It's still, you, you, this, this is uh, 201 on, on uh, of course, because of the volatility, it's kind of hard to really judge the numbers based on uh, based on um, individual days. But anyway, because you see for, for uh, September the 14th, you had 155 deaths. For September, as a, for the seven day period ending September the 9th, you were averaging 107, 108 deaths per day, okay? Now here's the good news. You, again, you can see this long declining pattern in cases. Now here's my question for you. How many of these people were vaccinated? Remember, if COVID-19 vaccine doesn't keep you from getting COVID-19, the question is how many of these people were vaccinated? And now you see weekly deaths. Again, weekly deaths are under 1,000 so far. Okay. Again, you can see a two-week declining pattern in deaths for sweet for Spain. Okay, monthly cases. Uh, you know, the last two months were not good. Monthly deaths, but you know, even though you are seeing a spike here, and you had a spike in uh, an, an increase in uh, August uh, of uh, COVID-19 deaths in, in Spain. This number is still below these numbers right over here, okay? So anyway, Spain, that does conclude your report for today. But before I let you go, don't forget to, uh, you know, click on that uh, subscribe button, click on the like button, and the share button. Share this video with your friends and family today. You can share it on Facebook, on Twitter. You can also cut and paste the link to the video in an email or text message. And again, before I let you go, thanks so much for the four young people who did watch this video yesterday. Be sure to invite your friends to, to join you on the to join you on this journey, okay? So let's just do an update here. Update it to zero. You know what's curious about this is about this new desk I'm using here. It feels different. The computer feels different than it does when it's sitting on on like a cushion, bay, uh, a cushion. Uh, as 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 on the as on the laptop thing I have. Uh, okay. I may have already done this before. I'm not quite sure. Okay. So that does include a report for Spain for today. We'll catch you tomorrow with an updated report.